Okay, guys, welcome to PCN's cha uh, channel. We are having a look at Street Fighter 2 on the Super Nintendo. Uh, so I've got an interesting story I'm going to go through on this. But let's do Super Nintendo Ryu. Uh, let's, do, let's do Ryu. Um, okay, so um, as you well know, this, this game was big. Um, when this came out, this was literally what every kid wanted. The, the Pokemon of its day, or whatever the kids, whatever trends kids are into now, I'm unsure. Because, you know, I'm not jiggy with it these days. I'm an old guy, I need that old stuff. Ooh. Okay, why you use uh, Dragon Punk Beats Ken's one there? Okay, take it around. Play this on deep, default difficulty, nothing too easy, nothing too hard. Um, so, <coughs> pardon me. Like I said, um, so Street Fighter 2 was the rage in its day. I mean, kids would save up their lunch money to play in the arcade or two to save up enough to get Super Nintendo. Um, so this game, uh, for some reason, uh, amongst my friends, uh, there, was, there was one friend that kind of got this before anyone else. Um, and, you know, guy was very, very cool. We all used to be around his house. <clears throat> we used to be around his house playing it. Not, not just me, but me and like another three, four of our friends. You know, very generous of the guy. His family were cool, used to let us in. Um, and I'll... Right, okay. Wow. <coughs> um, so, um, I remember playing, playing around his house. All of us, you know, having the versus games on this. So, when all this talk of Shenglong came around, um, I told him that, okay, if you... If you beat all eight of the characters without losing a round on the hardest difficulty, and I can't remember exactly what I gave him, whether he had to perfect all four of the last bosses, or whether he just had to perfect Bison in the end. Um, but I gave them, I gave them a very hard scenario to uh, to, com to complete, um, and, I, and I forgot about it. You know, I told them, I told them once, so they played the game on the hardest difficulty, not lose a round on the first day either perfect all four of the last bosses or just perfect bison dictator at the end and i said the the build that you have on uh, bison the last stage um it explodes and sheng long comes out and you get to play him uh, he, he fight he fights you and once he uh, once if you beat him you unlock him and you can play him and he's like the, the toughest character in street fighter now bear, bear, bear in mind these are the days without the internet you know, the only sources you've got is magazines or what people tell you. Uh, so we had like Mean Machines, Computer and Video Games. Games Master might have come around later. There was an American magazine called Electronic Games Monthly. So I made up the story about Shenlong. Didn't really think much of it. You know, there was a lot of BS surrounding Shenlong. So um, anyway, I forget about it. Maybe maybe two months down the line, approximately. You know, we didn't have mobiles then. House phone only. My house phone uh, rang. And my friend was called up i've never never heard him so he was calling me every name under the sun you know saying i'm this i'm that i'm the other and i'm like i've got no idea why he's so upset i've got no idea what's going on so you know i've asked him i've said to him yo you know what's what's up like what have i done what have i done to upset you why are you cursing at me um anyway he told me that after i told him the story of how to unlock sheng long him and his brothers literally made it their life goal um, to complete it with the scenario that I presented to them and they actually ended up doing it and were absolutely gutted when on the bison stage the bell didn't pop and no Sheng Long came out um, uh, and when he told me this uh, maybe I should have been a bit sy sy sympathetic but uh, I started laughing I mean I feel kind of bad now and you know, he kind of cursed him, and we kind of fell out over that. Um, didn't really speak to him for a long time after that. Um, yeah, didn't, didn't really speak to him, and and we fell out. So yeah, there was there was no Sheng Long, but but the guy persevered. He tried. He went on the hardest difficulty. He fought all the characters, perfect the bosses or the last boss level eight. Got it and got no Sheng Long. Um, so, and, and there was a lot of BS. I remember a computer games magazine like drew an image on on, on, on Street Fighter. I think about the meme machine or something. And they drew an image of like this guy that was supposed to be Sheng Long. Yeah, okay, done it. The triple dragon. 
And so, anyway, any of the old, real, real old schoolers out there that came when this when this game launched, you know, what were your stories of uh, Sheng Long? <laughs> Post the comments below. Did you have anything like this? You know, what was the what was the BS that you heard, or you know, like in my case, maybe made up? No, no, just do a dragon, he does blade kick. Okay, no, don't do a dragon from that close. <laughs> yeah, so this this game was, was big when it came out. You know, we, we there was different groups of friends. I, I obviously ended up getting this at some some point as well. Um a few of my other friends had it. The the the, the house where it thrived were where uh where you know the, the parents were cool with you having like lots of your friends around and, and i had a few friends like that uh one of my friends in particular he was like facebook literally like his dad was so cool there used to be like 20 of us cramped up in his room playing um anyway look the bonus stage in the snares the wall this replaces a different one one of the barrel ones i'm pretty sure the car's still in uh, in this Okay, I think you can beat this guy just by literally just just holding up. Let's try. Let's just hold up and press kick. Okay. I want to do nothing else. Oh look, he blocked it. Ah, oh, Gif Gif has tools now. Okay, I'm gonna do that second round. Might get a bit boring. I know, I, I, growing up, I preferred the SNES version over the, the Mega Drive one, but um, I, do, I do recall uh, reading an article where a lot of the CPS, a lot of the CPS one links were in uh, were in the Mega Drive version, but you couldn't you couldn't do them on the Super Nintendo. So maybe the, maybe the Mega Drive version ended up being the better version when you know deciphered and looked at very very closely. Either way, you know, it was it was good to have this game uh, as a kid. We're going to Brazil. We're going to fight Jimmy. Oh my God! Look at that! that was half his energy. Okay. I like this stage. And I always, always have. I have to say, my, my favourite colour of blank is like, the, the, always, has always been the blue one from when the cheat came out. If anyone remembers that on the snares, down R uphill YB if you had the European or the American version. But if you had the Japanese version, it was down our uphill YB XA. Checkmate. Still, still, if you give me a SNES pad in my hand, that's that's automatic. That that down our uphill YB or YB XA, just even without thinking. Okay. Oh, we got with we're there for Chalas now. Okay, look, look at him three by the on, but that guy has been choking that chicken for I don't even know how long. Like years, like almost close to 30 years. I mean just 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 kill the damn thing man and let it go. Just 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 stop choking it man. I'm playing this on an arcade stick, I, can't, I don't think I can play this on a SNES pad anymore. 
I have got a, like a USB SNES pad, but it just doesn't, I don't know, years of I guess playing fighting games on arcade sticks. I do play it on pads sometimes, especially when I use like my GPD uh, win or something, but I do find it a lot more difficult. Come on, Clayton. Oh, 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 I don't want to credit this man. Oh, no. Hey, I don't, I don't remember his formula. Round two, fight. Okay, final jump. Oh, oh it is. Oof, okay. Okay, same way with Honda. Okay, wow. That's a lot of doves coming out of that hat. I've counted at least 20. Guys, pro tip. If you're ever out and you need to park your car and you're near the seaside, you know, don't park it at the harbour or the pier. Especially if you see a boat that says Cap or Capcom in the background, just, just don't park it there because when you come back, you probably won't find your car. You, this is what you'll find, a big, a big bunch of metal, no wheels. So uh, pro tip, don't park your car there. This guy, he's still tough. All those, all those years later, Vegas still tough, man. Okay, okay. Is that how you do it? Just just keep dragging. That is a, let's see if it works again. Okay, good, good, good. That is a tough one. Okay, was that, was that what you do? Is that you knock him down and you keep doing dragons and he does his little, um, I forget what it's called now, his little hop. Okay, so get. 
Yeah. Remember the, 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 the alpha game where his chest lights up? No! I really, really kind of wish that that locked down, you know? I was hoping he was doing a normal tiger, but yeah. Ooh, okay. On to Bison, on to the Dictator. I'm gonna take down Shadow Lou. <laughs> then it's a gallery of mashup. I prefer the, the later images, the, the rebirth for the characters. Not all of them look great, like Blanca looks on budget. I really like the Super Nintendo sound effects, and I know they're different from the arcade. The worst thing I can do is jump back. Okay, hopefully the rest of it will be that easy. I, don't, I remember it being not so easy, but I think that Dragon Punch spam is, is quite powerful in this game, generally speaking. Nice. I thought he was dazed there because I was. What? This is dazed. Oh, okay. We've done it, guys. Let's see his ending. I remember, I remember the ending. Remember, endings was a big thing. Doesn't matter what game you played, you know, endings what you, is what you wanted to see. As the award ceremony begins, the crowd can be heard whispering. Where is the champion? Where is Ryu? Where is he? He's out. Looking for the next challenge, man. Walking off into a... I don't know if that's the moon or the sunset, man. But Ryu out. The fight is everything. That's what he likes doing. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Like I said, if you do enjoy the content, then you know consider subscribing, comment, like, shares, all that good stuff. Appreciated. Until next time, guys. PCN out.